This woman's life has been irreparably changed, all because she didn't pin her hair back, her long hair back, before she worked on her car. Now, her story is a warning to every woman, especially those who consider themselves handy around cars. Emma Cagliano has a report, and we should warn you, parts of it are very graphic. This woman is hiding a secret under her wig. Underneath is just me. Elon Abair, a mother of four, was scalped when her long hair was caught around a fan belt as she leaned into the hood to check on a mechanical problem. I just, without thinking, reached in, and when I did so, my hair got caught. Your children snapped yeah. right into action. You yelled they for help, did. and yep. one by one, they came running out. They did. Right, Sam? Took two, two, two helps. That was it. Sammy was right here. 30 seconds and he shut the car right off. Her son Sam showed us how he turned off the engine and her daughter Logan cut her hair free with these scissors. They were focused and they were driven by, I think, you know, the, they wanted to save their mom. Dr. Keeman Slaughter has been treating Elon's injuries at the Williams Center for Plastic Surgery in Albany, New York. One of the issues is that you have a lot of skin that we uh, essentially have to remove. Once we get that healed up, then we can do transplant surgery and get your hair back to where it was. Until then, she hides her injuries under the wig. I can put my wig on and I can go out and it seems like nothing changed. I can pretend that I'm the same and to show how quickly it can happen, we teamed up with auto safety expert Lauren Fix and placed a wig on this mannequin. Right, here we go. Then we eased it under the hood. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, oh wow. That that's unbelievable. That was so quick. In the blink of an eye, the mannequin is scalped. Just like what happened to Elon's hair, the wig is totally entangled in the fan belt. I'm using my full force. It really is unbelievable to see how tight this is wrapped around the belt. So what can you do? So the most important thing is you pull your hair back whenever you work on a vehicle. Okay. So let's do that right now. If you're thinking you're looking for a leak, you want to put your hands back, take off anything that's going to potentially get in the way. If you're replacing a headlight or you're you know, changing an air filter, shut the vehicle off. Vital lessons to avoid a tragedy like this.